Hi, this is Mark Cunaberti of Investing in Community video series where we bring the amazing organization, businesses, elections, politicians, and outlandish experiences happening around the county. And today, I'm with the lovely Crystal Highline. Hi, Mark. How, How are, are you? I'm, I'm doing great. fine, fine. <laughs> All right, <laughs> we're at 792A Searles Avenue, yes, down yeah. from Wild Mountain Yoga and SPD. That's right. And we're at the Sierra Commons, which is not a business incubator, but a business igniter. Business igniter. And they're igniting tonight the kickoff of outlandishexperiences.com. Right. Well, you go to the website and mm -hmm. you check out an amazing experience, yes. whether it be biking, mm -hmm. hiking, they amplify it and take it to a whole nother level. So don't settle for a regular bike ride, you right. settle for an amazing bike. Robert Trance, this is his idea. He's here tonight. We're at the opening party. Mm -hmm. We're going to check it out, take some video, and basically go on our own outlandish experience. That's right. So it's really a marketing platform. It's a website platform that if you, for example, if you go to, you want to ride and you go to Uber, you go to the Uber website, and then Jane Doe comes picks you up. Well, Jane Doe is, she's just her own business, right? And providing a service. So guides are providing a service to people that want to, you know, have cool experiences. So Outlandish Experiences has the technology and also curates these different experiences to have a nice round offering of awesome experiences. Yeah, sure, visitors come and they want to have experiences, but it's also locals can do it too. You got some friends coming into town, you wanna to do something cool? Check out Outlandish Experiences. Book something, it's an hour and a half. Totally memorable, people are gonna love you. And uh, you get to meet some super cool guides. traveled around the world and every place I go is Cuba, Costa Rica, Europe, Australia. You know, you get off the bus in a new place and there's someone there to greet you and offer you an authentic experience, show you the inside scoop about what's really going on in town. And it's awesome. Why not do that? It's a lot more difficult to walk around town and just go into stores and and it's not it's not the real deal. There's so many amazing why not? Yeah. yeah. So, Robert, why would I want to go on a walk with you or kayak with you? Okay, well, or it won't be with me. It'll be with one of the guys. Yeah. Because, you know, you go on a walk. Let's say it's a walk on a trail. You can come to town and you can see the trail map and you go on a walk on a trail and you go, oh, this is nice. All right. But if you go with the tribal spokeswoman for the local indigenous tribe and someone from the land trust or someone that knows the trails better than anyone around then they could say hey look there's um, a bird nesting in that tree hey did you know you can use this plant for this medicinal purpose you get all the in did you know there was a mine here did you know this did you know that and you get your, your mind gets blown by all the details and all the cool things. So Robert, my mom's coming to town. How does she get a hold of you? All right, well, you know, you can just go to like outlandishexperiences.com, but another scenario might be where uh, she booked a room at an Airbnb or a hotel, and the hotel is a member of our affiliate program, mm -hmm. and they say, hey, while you're in town to come see this awesome uh, festival at the fairgrounds or whatever, check out this website, outlandishexperiences.com and then they refer uh, people to the website. So it's locals helping locals, and that's what it's all about. Hi, 